Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Monica and I'm back with another update, another project pen. This time it's gonna be the team project pen. It's gonna be the update for uh, September. I believe it's update number 8. Anyway, let's see how I did since the last update. Hopefully my hair is not gonna fly in this video as in the last one. Anyway, let's see how many empties I have. This was um, for me a project pen with uh, probably the most empties that I have uh, from project pens. In this update since uh, the last um, the last one I have 10 empties. I have 7 in makeup, uh, 1 in fragrance and 2 in uh, body products. So um, let's see what I finished in fragrance because I have only one uh, product and was this room spray. It's from Bet and Body Works and this one was the sugar watermelon. Very powdery and sweet. I, uh, I did like it, I finished it. It takes a lot to finish one of uh, of those, and I'm using the fall scents uh, now. Then I finished this deluxe sample. This is the Laura Mercier, is the translucent, uh, well-known powder. Remains my favorite for some for uh, such a long time. Love this powder. I will uh, always have in my collection, and I have backups. Then I finished finally this uh, single eyeshadow from Tarte. This one was in the shade Pop Rock was kind of a rosy gold color. It's completely done and I'm uh, glad I finished it. Then I finished this um, eyeliner from uh, Marc Jacobs. This one is Marc Jacobs, the fine liner, I believe. Fine ultra skinny gel eye crayon. This one's uh, in the shade wine. And I finished it completely and uh, there is nothing to come out. Of course I did last time when I used it, I did one eye and then was done and I had to remove everything. But anyway, I have others and this color was not my favorite, I have other colors. Depending on the other um, eyeshadows that I use, sometimes I was looking like I was crying for two months in a row <laughs> with this one. But sometimes it looked, looked very well. Anyway, probably I'm not gonna buy this shade again. Then I have an eyeshadow, a liquid eyeshadow, another deluxe sample, and this one is from uh, Love of uh, Color, and I wish to tell you what shade was. Shimmer eyeshadow, the print is almost worn out, anyway it was a gold, I, I don't have even enough to swatch, but anyway I did uh, like it. Then I have two more uh, empties in here, yeah, two more empties in the makeup, and I have two eyeliners, one of them is from Sephora, is the red one, let's see if I can take this one from the lid, I can because I have those crazy long nails, anyway, I can take it out, it's done anyway, I have two more of this one and two more of this one. I'm trying to use them by the end of the year, but anyway, we'll see. I did like this one. I like the color and it stays very well. And also I finished the Estee Lauder one and this one was in the shade 18 nude. I cannot sharpen this one anymore. It's uh, completely done and I'm using the last two backups. So that's all as uh, makeup that I finished. As uh, No, I have one more. I finished the last two samples from um, Mary Kay. I had, I believe, seven of those. And those are the last two that I finished. was kind of dark and not my favorites. One was cream lipstick in Tend Besame. And the other one was a wine color, too dark for me. Confidence. So done with those uh, samples. Now I have uh, two empties, actually there are six products but I was counting them as um, and looks like I have one missing, I forgot one in my bathroom, it's a L'Occitane oil. I will insert a picture with that one because it's done but I don't know how come I don't have it with me. I used it in this morning uh, last time. Anyway, the rest of them are um, still from L'Occitane and this one is the ultra rich uh, lotion. And I had two of them. Also I have the ultra rich cream. Still two of them. And the last two are the shower cream. Lovely all of them. I really enjoyed the L'Occitane products. 
and that's kind of all us uh, empties now as the um, progress my palette looks like this the Too Faced Natural Love that I'm trying to finish it's not gonna happen probably not even next year but anyway I use the most this one because I'm using it as a base or, or uh, as an everyday color probably I will finish that one by the end of the year and then I use this one was the honey butter and then I use the moon bean beam which is this one I use this one a lot but still no pen I use the push up three times and I use uh, this one don't settle which is this one here twice and I never use uh, since the last update the other three my goal is to finish all of them but it's not gonna happen this year so that's with uh, that palette then let's see I will pick up random the rest of them I have with me with me only the ones that I use since the last update I have this eyeliner from Beauty for Real it's a gold one I don't know when this one is gonna be done because it's not uh, retractable so when it's done it's done then I had this sample from Coastal Sands, comes with two products, one is a blush, one is a highlighter and I use them, looks like uh, I'm kind of seeing the shape of the pen, hope to finish this one but we'll see. Eh? Then with the Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Soft Waves Sea Salt Spray I went down from here to here. I don't know, I will try to finish this one, but we'll see again. Waves are not my priority right now. I hope my hair still stays there. Then I have the Prep and Riley from uh, Prep Riley from uh, Dry Bar, Prime and Prep Detangler. And I am here right now. I introduced this one last time. And about introducing products, I am not introducing anything new. I am trying to finish what I have because I have a lot. Then I have the tree stick and this one is the contour stick. It's not gonna be done this year but I use it almost every time when I use makeup and I do like it, works very well. Then from um, Jennifer Lopez I have the steel perfume and with this one I went from the red line to the black one. I like this one when you apply it first it has kind of a slight uh, spicy note and it's really pretty really nice scent then from the body shop I had the Himalayan charcoal, charcoal purifying glow mask love this one this is all I have left in here it's less than half but it takes forever to finish a full size like this then I have the Garnier and this one is the BB Cream Miracle Skin Perfector in Light Medium. This is the product that I'm using right now in order to, to finish it. I will leave everything else away and I'm, I'm using only this one. And I am here right now. It might be done by the end of the year. Then I had the um, Pixie and this one is the Glow Mist and I went down from here to here I use it after I mark it this morning and I am even more lower this will be done next time from cover effects with the um, shimmer veil in amethyst I am lower than the last mark but I'm not gonna mark it it's still a lot of product in here but I love the color then let's see with the elf concealer this one is in fair but looks more like a medium i went from here down to here actually looks like i am even more lower but anyway i hope to have this done by my next update but who knows then i have this uh, estee lauder foundation and this one is the double wear in the color old or beige I repressed this one after the last update and this is all I have left love this one I will uh, definitely finish this one from Lorac I have the behind the scenes eye shadow primer I didn't mark it because I think it's a lot of air in here I cannot bend it but there is a change in the weight with the Becca 
this one is which one the Becca in champagne pop I use it three times because I'm uh, working on another highlighter to finish and definitely I'm not gonna finish the two of them so I'm concentrating on one but still using uh, this one once in a while two more products one of them is the juice beauty and is this eyeshadow crayon in a gray shade I was wearing this one and I got many compliments although it looks very ugly <laughs> but anyway there is not uh, much difference on the paper but I did use it and the last item in here is the Hula uh, bronzer which looks like uh, always although it's the single bronzer that I'm using there is no change in this one I don't know how many years it's gonna take me to finish this sample I use it all, almost every single day and th there is no pen yet. So that's kind of all for uh, this update. I will see you soon guys with um, probably some calendars because I'm waiting for a couple of them and then we'll want to have uh, more updates. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you so much for your comments. I will uh, see you soon. Bye bye.